kind of what you envisioned and dreamed of when you were Yeah, obviously they're a great team, experienced team. They do a great job on the defensive end especially. Um, and they, they got a lot of guys who have, you know, been here before. So we know it's going to be a grinding game. We know we're not going to be able to speed them, up, speed them up. It's a complete different style of game than we had tonight. So our coaches will know, you know, take time tonight, give us a great plan, and we'll meet in the morning and get ready to go, man. Their experience team, how does that kind of show when you play them? Yeah, they just they just don't panic. Um, I've heard somebody say, I think it was one of our coaches. You know, they were winning a few close games. Uh, conference back to back he was saying Virginia looks the same whether there's 18 minutes left in the first half or if there's two minutes left in the second half and they're down two um, they don't they don't get sped up they have a great coaching staff and obviously we have a lot of respect for them so we know it'll be a tough one but, you know, we're, we're ready for the challenge we're excited how big was it for, for Ben and Ian to step up like they did with oh man the they played awesome I'm so proud of them. Uh, those guys work their tail off uh, every single day. They've been doing that for a long time. So to see them step up like that and you know, really help us win tonight uh, it just, it just means a lot to me and I'm just really proud of them. Did you guys send a message to the Fletcher Committee tonight? Absolutely. Uh, you know, I, I think we should be in. I don't think there's a question about it. I thought we should be in before tonight. Um, at the end of the day, we're going to let y'all talk about all that. We're just going to be on the court and do our jobs. Three times, NC State, they're projecting number 10 seed coming into this game. And you threw them out off the court three times. I mean, what's the key to I mean, playing those guys? Yeah, they're, they're a great team. they got a lot of great players. But, uh, you know, our coaches really did a great job giving us a good plan. We bought in uh, every game we've played them. And I think that's that's been the difference. It was very disruptive defensively for you guys in the second half. You held them to over 11, I think. What, what were some of the key things? Were there big adjustments in the half or anything? Or what do you think triggered the team? You know, obviously, uh, they're a great transition team. Yeah. So our offense was a big reason to them not being able to get out in transition. We made them play in the half court. We tried to play them physical, tried to make it tough on them. And I think that was a big reason. Uh, you know, this what do you remember from the Virginia game? It was only about a week ago. And there were some things you kind of process and evaluate going to tomorrow. Yeah, obviously they're a great team, uh, experienced team, We've got a lot of great players. And, they're great from the defensive end. So you really got to move the ball. It's a complete different style of game than we had tonight. So, you know, we're just, our coaches will meet tonight, give us a plan, and we'll buy into it in the morning, and we'll get ready to come back and do our jobs.